beauties. Um, so first, I just want to thank you guys for, even though I told you I wasn't pregnant, still crossing your fingers for me. That was really, really nice of you. Um, cycle day one was on Thursday. So my doctor said that she wanted me to take Clomid cycle days three through seven. So I started on Saturday. Um, I took my first pill Saturday evening. Saturday morning, I went in and had some blood drawn. So um, tonight, that makes tonight cycle day seven. So I am taking my final pill. And I thought some of you girls that have not taken Clomid before, and I don't know about anyone else's experience, but this is what my Clomid looked like. When I went and picked up my prescription, I was expecting like some pill bottle, but instead it looks like they ripped this off a thing of Benadryl. Um, on the back, it's really tiny writing, I have no idea what this looks like, but um, it's a Clomiphene Citrate Tablet, 50 milligrams, and it's just a little tiny white pill. Um, it's kind of like an uncoated aspirin, at least mine is, and I'm really not good at taking pills. I have to like put the pill in my mouth and then take just the right amount of water and tilt my head, head back at just the right angle and kind of shake it back and forth until it's centered and then swallow and then usually I have to take another gulp of water because it's stuck in my throat. <laughs> so the uncoated tablets are kind of gross because they start disintegrating before I even swallowed them. But it's just a tiny little white pill. Even I can handle that. <laughs> just a little thing. So I'll take that later tonight. Um, so far I haven't really had any of the side effects. I take it at night um, with a small, you know, a couple crackers, a little small little snack, and some water. Um, I take it at the same time as my chewable prenatal vitamin. <laughs> I'm such a dork. And, um, and I've been taking an extra um, tablet of vitamin C. Just because um, I've been in the office a lot lately and my coworkers are all getting sick, so <laughs> I'm trying to fight it off. It's either an extra vitamin C or a face mask. So, with this acne, I've been considering the face mask, but I don't think the uh, bosses would like that so much. So, I'm currently on cycle day seven. Um, oh, I got my husband's semen analysis back. And let me go grab it. One second. Hi. Okay, so I got it from my doctor when I was in there for my blood work. Um, apparently, unlike my general practitioner that mails me a copy of all my lab results, they are not going to tell me the results unless there's something abnormal. So I'm going to have to like request it every time I go in. So I got his count back. Um, he has 135 million sperm per milliliter. And I guess the normal range is uh, 20 million or more. So 20 million or more, he has 135 million. I think that's pretty good. <laughs> the nurse was impressed. Um, my husband is chock full of sperm. <laughs> chock full. Um, their motility. Uh, I guess normal is 50% or greater, and his is 69, so that's good. Um, his morphology, the normal is 30%. His was a little low at 23%, but let's see, 30% of 20 million is 6 million, right? Yes. Um, so, you know, 23% of 135 million, that's a heck of a lot more than 6 million. So they didn't seem to think that it was that big of an issue um, just because this count was high. So what do you guys think about that? Count is 135, motility is 69, and morpholo morpholo morphology is um, 23. Feedback. Um, but that looks good to go. At least I think so. Hi, Apollo. Don't step on Dad's semen analysis. Come here. Come say hi. Oh, so cute. <laughs> Come down there, critter. Um, 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm in the middle of a movie here. Okay. Ah! <laughs> You're being so strange. Okay. <laughs> what is your problem? Where's a ball? Go get a ball. <laughs> oh great, it was right down on the floor. <laughs> Okay, so um, I just threw the ball for Apollo after he was like horsing around up here. Hi. <laughs> okay, great, thanks. Um, but I had just taken my last Clomid pill out of the safety pack <laughs> and set it on the couch and then he goes horsing around and I was just having to dig under the couch trying to find my Clomid pill. These things are like gold. They're like gold, Apollo. These are my magic baby pills. I, th I thought Apollo was gonna eat them. <laughs> mm, candy. Tic Tac. Yes. Anyway, all right. Chill out. Hey, enough, enough. Okay, so on the house front, we were supposed to close today and the seller is slow, and my loan guy is slow. Chris and I are just like, we've turned everything in. We are good to go. Let's wrap this up. So it looks like we're going to be closing the first week of May, which, good. Let's get it done. I'm ready to move. I'm ready to move. Cool. Yeah. So I will keep you guys updated. Um, starting, let's see, today is Wednesday, cycle day seven. So starting on Friday the 9th, I'm gonna be peeing on a stick every morning, waiting for a faint uh, ovulation line. And then as soon as I get my faint line, I will go in for my mid-cycle scan. So I'll keep you guys all updated. Um, big follicles and baby dust to everybody. Bye beauties. You say bye? You say bye? Oh, God, Apollo, you're nuts.